really, uh, you know, for us, just a, a terrific team, team win and, uh, and team effort. And I think uh, De Devin has been so good <laughs> and so special that uh, uh, I think sometimes the, the effort that, that our entire team is putting forth and, and uh, you know, the games that we have won, what we've needed to do uh, to, to win, um, it's gone a little overlooked. I mean, just, you know, I mean, tonight was a great example of just, uh, you know, our guys continuing to, to, to fight and play and, and uh, you know, try, try to find a way to win. And, you know, so many different guys, you know, making plays and, and, and doing good things. And, you know, obviously, Brandis is going to step out uh, or stand out tonight. Uh, he was huge, made a ton of really big shots uh, in the second half for us. But, you know, we really have everybody, you know, Lakeem Jackson, huge offensive, huge offensive boards uh, late uh, down the stretch, you know, um, when, when, when we needed them. And, uh, you know, St. Boldro, you know, another night where he's, he's solid. And, also, Steve gave us good things. Even the guys that didn't score, you know, they, they gave us good things. And so, um, you know, we, we weren't too worried. Like a lot of our games this year at halftime, uh, you know, it was a situation where we had not thrown it in the ocean. I thought we got great looks. We're 0 for 9 from 3. They just didn't go in. And yet, you know, it's a couple possession game. And so, um, you know, we, we felt like we were, you know, in, in, in there and uh, just, you know, able to able to get enough stops and, and make enough plays and be a really good Florida team. And, you know, we were really fortunate to get the win. And, I thought the crowd was great in the second half, uh, a little bit like us in the first half. Not so great, but great in the second half. And uh, you know, good, good, good total team uh, win tonight. We were a really good win for our program. Darren Brandis' game, I mean, did that his three-point shoot, shooting seem to turn things in the second half? Oh, I don't think there's any question. I told him at the, the first media time out of the second half, we, you know, we got a turnover, which was a huge key to the game, and we were plus 14. And uh, Devin penetrated through the ball in the corner, and you know he, he's leading the country in shot fakes coming into the game uh, tonight. Um, and uh, he shot fake, passed up a shot. And I told him at the media timeout, he passed up another three. He was coming out, so um, you know. And I, and I thought, you know, to his credit, he, he stepped up and and, and took uh, some really big shots and, and made them for us. Darren, did you talk about energy so often during the course of the season and its importance? How did you feel about the energy level? Of the I, I think for the most part, you know, good. Uh, obviously, second half, uh, much better, I think. But, you know, the, the fact of the matter is, you know, you're, you're going to have a little bit more when you're a little better offensively. And, uh, again, I thought we got really good looks in the first half. They did not go down. In the second half, we made a few. And, and I thought we, you know, we played with a lot more a lot more energy on both ends. But, uh, you know, all in all, you know, our, our thing coming in tonight was just to compete, play as hard as we could, and uh, you know, keep playing the next play, regardless of uh, whether it was going great or, or not going good. And, and you know, I think I think we did that. How much of Florida's sloppiness was them, and how much was you? Oh, I, you know, I, I don't know. I don't, I don't think we were, were tremendous. I'm, I'm sure they feel like they could have could have taken care of it a little bit better. But I thought, you know, there were times where, you know, we were pretty active and, and, and did some positive things uh, as well. I, I, I think that's, you know, always a little bit of both. Darren, did it surprise you that they went to the fouling strategy with two minutes left in just a four-point game? I mean, you know, not necessarily. I mean, you know, that's, that's what they chose to do, and, um, you know, you guys can question him if you want. I'm not. You know, he's got two rings in the Hall of Famer, and, and uh, I think he knows what he's doing. He knows his team. How Devin and the ankle look? I'm, I mean, you know, it looked good to me. Uh, you know, <laughs> I mean, tw 24, uh, four rebounds, a couple of big rebounds in traffic, you know, two, two, four steals. I mean, you know, played 34 minutes. You know, was 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 he as explosive as he, he could be? You know, I, I don't know, but I, I don't think he showed up. And, Again, we, we, didn't, we didn't think it was that serious what would have happened. Just wanted to, to, to be cautious with it. And, um, you, you probably have to saw a limb off for him not to play anyway. Uh, so, but I thought he did good. To you go from the SEC's teams, uh, obviously there's going to be a little bit of a rivalry, but you see something kind of building the last couple of years with, with all these tight finishes? I mean, I, I think they've been really good games. Um, but, you know, I think a lot, of, a, lot, a lot of our games are like that in the East. Um, you know, uh, our crowds have been, you know, the, the four games I've been a part of, the crowds have been good at both places. And, they have been good basketball games, and so um, you know I think that uh, you know, they've been uh, they've been fun to be a part of. How you go from eleven point lead with forty nine seconds and win by five to relax in I'm sorry. Uh, by eleven at forty nine seconds and win by five, did you relax in between there? Yeah, you know I think that um, you know their strategy obviously was to get it down the floor as quick as possible, and, and we were zoned, hoping they take some time and they drove through it, so then we changed the man and, and they drove through it again, and uh, you know to their credit they made a few plays. Uh, and, and uh, you know, there are a couple times we probably didn't handle it as that well. One time when they got the and one, you know, where we were supposed to have a big there helping on the penetration, and he, he wasn't there. And so, um, 
tailgate, but uh, you know, just didn't what we had to do. Coach, how big was Sam had eight rebounds tonight? I'm sure that, that really helped in terms of you know, keeping Florida off the boards. Yeah, you know, Sam's been really good for a couple weeks now. Uh, you know, 16 and 8, and, you know, career, uh, I, I call it career high. You guys may call it career low, not turning the ball over. You know, it was, it was great. Uh, you know, so I, I, thought, I thought Sam was, was outstanding and uh, gave us some presence. And, you know, again, it, you know, it goes back to, you know, the team, total team effort, you know, and, and, and continuing to build our program. I mean, there's a guy that's, you know, playing very well for us. And uh, we, know, we all know how special Devin is. And, you know, Ross steps up. Sam's now starting to consistently give us really good things. And, and you know, you have the other guys I mentioned. I thought Will Galloway played really well tonight, hit a couple shots that were big, and played solid, had a huge steal late. That's you know that's that's what we want uh, from our team, and that's, and that's the only way we're going to have an opportunity uh, to, to to beat teams like this, and to, to just like we want to down the stretch. I know you say they're all important, but after Saturday, just to get a win any way you could before you go on the road for two, is that for spirits and momentum? Is that pretty crucial? Uh, I think this one was huge for a lot of reasons. Uh, a lot of reasons, you know, how we played Saturday, and just you know coming out and uh, you know playing you know, with some pride, sort of sort of redeeming in terms of how you play. Uh, it was big for us. It was a big thing for us. You know, I think the fact that uh, they were ahead of us in division play, that they're for sure an NCAA tournament team, and it's going to give us another top 50 win. I mean, you know, all, all of those kind of things, uh, you know, I think a lot of factors tonight. So this is a really, really big win. Have you seen the team affect the pain any better than they did in the first half? Yeah, you know, again, I, I think that they're, they're, re they're really long. I think the thing that's deceiving uh, about Florida is they're, they're extremely long. They, they do a good job with their zone. I mean, they're, they're good at it. And, uh, uh, you know, again, I, I thought we got some pretty good shots, and they just uh, they just didn't go in. But, uh, uh, you know, our guys stuck with it and, you know, hit a lot of free throws, shot a great percentage, you know, which is another positive. Uh, but, you know, found a way to put 70-plus on the board, which, you know, for us is an accomplishment with uh, how we've been struggling on the offensive end. All right, guys. Thank you. Coach Donovan.